Hey, what is going on fam? It's your boy Swift and we are back with some more legends. So as you guys know, I finally pulled my first copy of Ultra Gogeta a couple days ago. It was actually the last day the banner was live, so I got extremely lucky and I wanted to throw him on a sweaty team and just really see what he can do. Um, you know, remember he is only five stars, so let's kind of showcase what he can do at five stars. Let's jump in. All right, we got a really stacked fusions team here. That's not a good start. Let's go to future Gohan, destroy his cards. There's the second blue. Got him in the sidestep, I'll take it. Okay. Actually not doing bad damage here for how tanky this guy's team is. Yeah, clean 50% of his health. Okay. Unfortunately, I don't have any key. Okay. I had a feeling he was going to swap out right there. This is kind of... I, I probably shouldn't have done this. Now that I think about it, I don't know why I did this. I mean, let's see what type of damage it's going to do first. Remember, this is a five-star Gogeta. Okay. Normally, when I'm, like, showcasing these units, I, I kind of play differently than I normally do. Like, I'd, I'd go out of my way to land blue cards and, you know, just see what the damage is. And it just so happens that, uh, this Gogeta's blue card is busted, so... This is gonna hurt. Ouch. Okay, got him in the side step. I should. You know what? I think I'm. I might just rush. I don't know. Does he have time to swap out? Okay. I was gonna say, I don't wanna waste too much time and then pop my ultimate and then he just sacks off Majub. Like, if I can get the kill on Ultra Gogeta right now, then I'd much rather do that. So. This is fine. I kind of wasted my main ability, though. I didn't really have to pop my main ability right there, but no worries. That's fine. Ooh, he got me. Oh, wow, he actually rushed right there. I'm not gonna lie, I did not expect that. Okay. Let's pop my main as well. Hit him with the blue. The strike cards are sealed. Let's go for a tackle. Nice, got him in the sidestep. This should be a dead Gogeta. Maybe this doesn't kill. Or no, it should. It's future Gohan. It does, okay. Yet, yeah, 1.9 million. Okay, got rid of his Vanish. This is getting a little bit too close here. Wait, what's he doing? Oh, is he, like, trying to get his Vanish back? He got his Vanish back. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Okay, okay. I think this is gonna be game. I was getting a little bit nervous there for a second. GG's. All 
All right, this time we got a GT set up with LF Forku. Got him with the tackle tech. Let's cancel. Is he not going to go to Gogeta? Okay, there's Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. That's what I was worried about. Got him in the side step. I'll take it. Not doing too much damage here. Let me cancel. Let me cancel. Thank you. Actually, I think I'm just gonna rush. Even if he goes to Majub, that's fine, because I still have my main ability to pop afterwards. So, yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Oh, my timing was barely off. No! I was trying to swipe, but it, for some reason registered as a backdash. Okay, that didn't that did not work out like I wanted it to. Yeah, this is slowly backfiring on me. Okay, we can go to future Gohan here. This actually might kind of even the playing field up a little bit because him using his rush on future Gohan is actually going to kind of help me. Okay, got him with the, uh, the good old one-two step. Okay, it's going to be a dead Gogeta. Ooh, nice patience on his part. God, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta having those cover changes is, is so valuable. No, he gets the PV! Okay, I'm not really too worried now. It actually did way more damage than I was expecting. But remember, it is a 5-star Ultra Gogeta. Let's get the damage. Or wait, he's dead, isn't he? Yeah, he's dead. Ah, he gets another PV. Ah, dude, the PVs are just not on my side this game. Wait, that actually killed me? Oh my gosh. Dude, that damage was really impressive from uh, LF Forku. Holy cow. Like, I was not expecting that to kill me. Like, at all. I'm shooketh. I am shooketh. I might lose this game now. There's a big possibility I lose this game. I just was not expecting that to kill Ultra Gogeta. Once again, it is a 5-star Ultra Gogeta. I think obviously if I had him like 14 stars right there, he would not have died. But... Yes! Got him with the tackle tech, baby! 
Let's go. That was way too close. Way too close. GG's. All right, we got a LOE team. This can be a pretty tough team to deal with, even with Ultra Gogeta. Okay, he has no Vanish. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think he has a Vanish. All right, let's hit him with the blue, destroy his cards. We'll hit him with another blue. Or actually, no, no, we won't, because I'm not gonna have enough key. Okay, maybe I'm getting a little, little bit too cocky. Yeah, I was gonna say I, I do do not even have a vanish right there. I should have swapped out. Ooh, nice combo drop on his part. Okay, that actually worked out pretty well. I could have saved that ultimate, but I really had nothing else to do right there. Um, this kind of give this kind of gives me the perfect amount of time to, uh, you know, swap out now. Okay. Getting, uh, getting rid of that revival is definitely going to make it a little bit easier to take this team down. I don't know if this is the best choice, but I'm just going to rush. Because, let's face it, if I pop my ultimate right there, he's just going to go into the yellow Frieza, and I don't think it's even going to get the kill. Um, I think just rushing and getting rid of somebody here is, is the better move. And the good thing about Ultra Gogeta is I do have the possibility of drawing that second ultimate as well. Okay, got the PV. Might as well hit him with this ultimate. Oof, that actually almost kills. I was expecting good damage, but I wasn't even expecting that much damage. That was impressive. Ooh, I was a little bit late on that green card. If I would have clicked that green card just a second sooner, dude. That would have been dirty. Okay, got him with the full screen. Okay, I think somebody's just dead. Yeah. Yeah, okay. G, G's. Alright, we got another pretty stacked team here. I think this guy had like a 14-star Ultra Gogeta as well. So we'll see how this goes. Okay, I'll take some free damage. I am definitely cool with some free damage. I'm not gonna complain. I don't think I'm gonna have enough to fill up my gauge. Almost. Okay. Sit him with the blue. Oh, he actually pops a blue card his himself. Please sidestep. Thank you. And we'll get some decent damage here. Oh, never mind. 
forgot about that, actually. Okay, this is fine. Well, he already used his save with um, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. Okay, I'll take it. Alright, let's just immediately hit him with the ultimate. If he doesn't swap out, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, this is going to be a dead Goku. I think. It should be. Oh yeah, yep, he's dead. That's definitely going to help out. And so I believe his Bardock does have Endurance now. I think. Ooh, nice timing on his part. Oh, this is not good, I think. Is my Gogeta just dead? Oh, I can survive that, I think. Oh yeah, we live. We live. Got him with the single tap! Let's go! Bro, you gotta swap out, bro. I was going to say. That's fine. Okay. Not going to lie, I got a little lucky with the uh, PV right there, but that's fine. And I think Bardock is dead. Yep, that is going to be game. GG's. Alright, going up against a 14-star Beerus. I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit jealous. Uh, I summoned for that Beerus and I couldn't even get a single copy. I'm, I'm a little bit jealous. Okay, got lucky with the Blast Armor. I'll take it, though. Oh, he goes into Jiren right away. Got him with the Tackle Tech. Doing some hefty damage. Let's hit him with the blue, destroy his hand. I'm not gonna lie, Beerus actually tanked that pretty well. Okay. Let's just immediately pop the ultimate. This is super early. Oh, he has time to go back to Jiren. Well, that's fine. I'm still going to do some really good damage here. And he doesn't have endurance until I use my rush. So. Yo. Okay, yeah, he's just dead. Like I said, I didn't even rush, so. Ah, uh, bad, uh, bad timing on my part right there. Alright, I'll just go to Gogeta. He's probably just gonna switch back to Goku, yep. No! That's not good. Okay, we live those, we live those. Let's go ahead and get that type neutral. Ah, that was super risky of me just going right away like that. I should have had some patience myself. Well, this is fine. I mean, future Gohan can tank. We still got the Endurance. Oh, that's huge. That's actually huge. Alright, that's a dead Beerus. It's fine. Got rid of his Vanish. Unless he uses a blue card. Does he have a blue card? Nope. That is going to be game. Look at this damage we're doing. So basically my conclusion so far about a 5 star Ultra Gogeta is 5 star Ultra Gogeta is definitely viable in the higher ranks. Um, his damage output is still very very good at 5 stars. It's really his defenses is where you notice a big difference between like 5 and 14. Um, a 14 star Ultra Gogeta is just super tanky.
All right, we got a Super Saiyan team. Okay. I'll take it. Is he gonna try to swap out? And let's hit him with the blue, destroy his cards. The good old Ultra Gogeta blue card. Ah, uh, should have vanished. I should have vanished right there. Oh. Okay, I'll take that. The strike cards are sealed. Alright, I think that's a dead Bardock. Okay, that is going to be game. GG's. And that is actually going to be the last match of the video, guys. I appreciate you guys so much for stopping by. Definitely stay tuned for more. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.